Okay, Dean, it's uh, March 25, 2013. We're doing a uh, right knee arthroscopy. And we're having a look. This is a little drainage tube that I have in your knee. A little, it's about five millimeters in size, so it's pretty, or diameter, it's pretty small. And that white um, above, that's your kneecap or patella. That's a little bit of frayed cartilage there. It's pretty minor. It's not, not a big deal. I'll clean that up. Um, and there's the outside or the lateral part of your patella or kneecap. We're coming down, looking at the kneecap. Actually, your MRI seemed to show it looked a little worse than that, so that's good news. That kneecap doesn't look quite as much as I thought. I thought there might be a bit more changes on it. And then the kneecap slides up and down the groove on the thigh bone or the femur. And that's where it goes, right there. You can see that little blister in the cartilage there. Just a little flap and a blister. Again, it's pretty small, but that's from getting down into the hack too many times. So that can kind of irritate a little bit. So we'll clean that up a little bit, and hopefully that'll help. Now I'm looking down in the outside part of your knee. It's called the lateral gutter. Uh, so this is the outside part. That's a normal little tendon in the knee called the popliteus tendon. Looks very normal. That's a, that white edge there is where the lateral meniscus or outside cartilage is. And that looks perfectly normal. Now we're going to go look towards the inside part of your knee. There's the medial gutter. And that also looks normal. It's a little, little bit red, but... Nothing too bad. Now we're going to look towards the inside of your knee and right away I can see the cartilage tear. So there's your meniscus tear. And as, again, that's a little bit more than what the MRI said. So I could see how that could continue to bother you. So I think it's a good idea that we're here. Yes, please, yeah. I'll take an 11 blade, please. Coming in, this is just a small little scalpel blade here. That's on the inside part of your knee. And this is just a probe. The bend part is five millimeters in size. So this is uh, the cartilage over your femur or thigh bone. Well, it looks, for the most, most of it's normal. So this here is the meniscus or cartilage here. And we'll see this better, but here's part of your torn cartilage. And this here is the tibia or shin bone. You look towards the inside part of your knee. This is ACL, the one Matt Dominguez tore many times. And uh, yours looks fine. And there's your PCL. And that's it. So the anterior cruciate ligament and the posterior cruciate ligament, they look fine. So now we're going to look a little bit closer at that inside cartilage of your knee. Take that footstool, please. And so now we're just opening up your knee, and there you can see the torn cartilage. And yeah, I'm really this is this is more than a horizontal cleavage tear. This would have kept bugging you. So definitely not something that tends to heal itself, and it'll keep irritating. You can see there's a, a flap that's folded underneath. And there you can see some more fraying of the cartilage, but a pretty simple one to treat too, so we'll just clean that up. And uh, so this is a little shaver and has suction attached to it. And it takes the edges of the torn cartilage and removes them. There's that flap underneath, there it goes. It's gone now. Just a little bit there. Do you have Accufix instruments, please? Yeah, right here. Yeah. Okay, good. And now we're gonna just just trim there a little bit. 